Okay, number four. What is 0 0.75 as a fraction? So in order for me to convert, um, this here is a decimal, right? This guy here is a decimal. I have a decimal place like so. So how, how do I convert this? Well, I know that this here is a, I want to go from a decimal to a fraction, right? So first, all I'm going to have to do is I'm going to actually analyze this decimal here. So this decimal contains three places, right? I, or in this case, two places. This guy here is our whole number, so we added zero, so we don't really care about this guy. So this guy is our whole number, and it's not part of the decimal places. Place it. So here's our whole number. This guy here is our tens digit. And this guy here is our hundreds digit. Let me write this on top, actually, so you can see it better. Our tens digit. This here is our hundreds digit. So if I want to write it as a fraction, so 0 0.75 as a fraction, this is going to equal, um, as you can see, I have two decimal places and I have a digit in my uh, hundreds digit. So therefore, my denominator is going to be 100. And then uh, that's to figure out the den denominator find, uh, to just basically see the last digit and see what uh, what place it, ho it holds in the decimal. And then we are going to look at uh, the numerator, which is simply just the decimal itself. So in this case, this case, it's 75 here. So we're taking everything that is um, uh, the two decimal places that exist after the decimal. So we have this as our fraction here. And what we can do is we can actually reduce this to lowest terms, right? So this is going to equal... We reduce to lowest terms. We can say that we're looking for a common denominator between 75 and 100. In this case, I would look at. Actually, I know that 25 here is a um, is a uh, uh, greatest common factor because um, it goes into 75 and it also goes to 100. And the only reason why I know this is because I'm thinking this in terms of money. I have three quarters is going to be 75 five cents and four quarters is going to be 100. So I know that this here is. Um, divisible by 25. So therefore, the fraction here is 3 over 4. So 3, 3 fourths is my fraction reduced um, is 0 0.75 as a fraction reduced to lowest terms. So the solution here is correct. It says here in the given case, you have a 0 0.75. It's converted to 75 over 100, which is equal to 3 over 4. So this solution here is correct. It's a good analysis as well. Thank you.